Hi, Papa. Me and Aiden are going to be reading um, The Night Before Christmas to you with a very special guest. I hope you like it. It was the night before Christmas when all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care in hopes that St. Nicholas would soon be there. The children were nestled, all snug in their beds, while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had a settled, had just settled down for a long winter nap. But out on the lawn there arose such a clatter. I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flag, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the wreath of the new fallen snow gave a luster of mid midday to objects below. When, what to my wondering eyes should appear, but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be Saint Nick. More rapid than eagles, eagles, his courses, ah, coursers they came and whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, and on Donner and Blitzen. On top of the port, on top of the wall. Now dash away, dash away, dash away all. Right? And then in a twinkle I heard on the roof the prances and pawing of each little foot. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed <laughs> He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys had he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opened his pack. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how, the, how merry, his cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry, his drawl little mouth was drawn op up like a bow, and the bear... The beard on his chin was as white as the snow. His eyes, how hardly twinkled his dimples, how merry his cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry, his droll little mouth was thrown like a bow. And the beard on his chin was white as the snow. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke is it circled his head like a leaf. He had a broad face and a round little belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl of jelly. <laughs> ha, ha, ha! I like jelly. Me too. You like jelly? I eat pizza. He was chubby and plump and right jolly old elf. And I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. I'm an elf. A wink of his eyes and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings, then he turned with a jerk. And laying his fingers aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney, he rose. And giving up a nod up the chimney, he rose. The chimney. Yeah. He sprang to his sleigh, to his hand, gave a whistle, and away they flew, like the dawn on a thistle. But I heard him exclaim as he drove out of sight, Happy Christmas to all, and to all a good night. Hey, Papa would be happy to see you. I wonder where he is. 
He'll be here. Do you think Papa's Santa? He's definitely Santa. Second, what? you are Papa. Hey. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Yeah. Then why aren't you, no. wearing, why aren't you wearing your shoes? Well, but I don't want to walk. Them. Merry Christmas, Papa. We miss you, and we hate that we can't see you this year. But next year, we'll all be together. We love you. Bye. Bye. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Merry Christmas.